yo what is going on guys we are back with another dokkan battle video man and uh, it's here now first and foremost before we read the information they didn't really do too much to them but they did enough to push them past right i think with this buff they're instantly back in the top 10 like they didn't even really go anywhere i'd say they probably dropped below to like top 20 because these guys were still a monster they were just you know I mean, still right now, with their new details, they're still not the best at slot 1. But, you know, without a further ado, let's just uh, read the uh, information. Shout out to Goresh, as always. He got the transitions done really, really quick. So, you know, shout out to him for that. And this is why we all know and love the homie, right? Because, you know, those speedy transitions. But, EZA, Goku, and Frieza, final form, Angel, and um, Miraculous Outcome. We already know that. Their new leader skill is, is still the same, but their tech type has went from 90 to 120 percent now i heard in i think one of true's video he was actually saying that they might not even change the 7 7 because you know it's all about universe 7 this um uh, anniversary right so it actually made sense that they kept it the same but he did say that the tech leader skill will go up which is exactly what they did and this is sbr category leader like esbr category lead worthy now because they actually were a pretty good lead before but now they're like definitive because that 120 buff is pretty pretty good now um their new super attack their new 12 key limit breaking assault extreme raises defense for one turn and causes colossal damage it didn't even do that by the way it never used to do that the only thing it did before was and it lowered the enemy's attack now it raises defense so it's just it's crazy and it still lowers attack now um their new one does uh their new 18 key miracle of universe 7 extreme raises defense for one turn and causes mega colossal damage to enemy and like i said again their old 18 key only lowered attack and defense but now it raises a defense and it lowers attack and defense so these guys literally all they needed was the defensive buff because they hit hard already and that's exactly what they got now for the passive miraculous uh, uh, miraculous co cooperation attack and defense plus 77 when attacking plus an additional attack and defense plus 77 when um performing an ultra super attack they didn't even get that defense by the way and uh plus an additional attack plus 77 when the targeted enemy is attacked down defense down stunned or sealed which before it was only attacked down these guys and also they get a key they get one key every turn for a max of seven turns so do you know how easy it's going to be to get that 18 key off? You're rarely going to see that 12 key after a couple turns because if you guys don't know, especially them being a universe seven, uh, reps of universe 7 lead for that huge stat. First of all, tournament of power units, we all know how crazy their links are in terms of key because they already get that 3 key and they all link up really, really well together, especially universe 7 warriors. So these guys are going to be having 18 keys probably by th turn 3. Like it's just, it's going to be easy to get their 18 key off. And with that 18 key is going to come so much stuff. And these guys just became one of the best Super Battle Road units, hands down. Leader skill, passive skill. Literally, if you just do attack down, defense down, seal, or stun the enemy, which is going to happen. It's going to happen. So, well, in Super Battle Road, obviously, Dokkan events nowadays, you can't really do that. But in Super Battle Road, these guys are going to be so good, which is actually content that you really need them for, right? And even Legendary Goku event, you could take them. I mean, whenever they release the... Uh, joint forces um uh universal uh, joint forces uh mission right where you have to take in joint forces you could use them or when they release um reps of the universe 7 um mission right but all in all these guys like i wouldn't even say their buff was that good but it was it's good enough like it's way more than good enough shout out to five nine they're going live too you know trying to cover the information and once again shout out to the homie garage again these guys are gonna be ridiculous it's it's crazy i wish i had them on jp but i guess i'll have to wait until late july august almost right in order before i get them because luckily i do have them on global and i cannot wait i probably will get them to full level 10 links before the anniversary and yeah they're gonna be doing some dumb numbers all right but uh yeah if you guys did enjoy make sure you guys smash that subscribe button smash that like button for your boy and i'll see you guys in the next one